We thought this morning, being Valentine's Day, would be a good day to update you on the Parade of Hearts. It's a project to put these iconic KC hearts all over town. And KCHB 41 News reporter Charlie Keegan has a live update for us this morning, showing us all kinds of different artwork on these. And you've got a new one here that you want to show us this morning, Charlie. Good morning. I sure do. Good morning to you, Taylor and Ray. Yes, we want to highlight this particular heart here behind me. And who better to talk to it about than the woman behind it? This is Sarah Kramer, the heartist behind this piece. So, Sarah, thanks so much for being here. Tell us a little bit about what we're looking at. Maybe start here with the sunflower in that upper corner. Yeah, good morning. Um, well, the sunflower, you know, it's known for being warm and inviting. And, of course, it has a connection to Kansas, so I thought that might be a nice... Um, element to feature right. on my heart. There we go. We're going to show you what you featured on the back. Let's okay. flip this around here a little bit. Tim, bear with us there. All right, I'll grab it from this end, and you can see more of the honeycomb and a giant bee over here. What's the theme here with the honey and the bee? Well, Kansas and Missouri share their state insect, so I did want to include that. And of course, the honeybee uh, symbolizes hard work and community, and that is sort of the center of, of the mission of this project and then the honey or the honeycomb the colony of course the bee cannot survive without being a part of so right. i thought that those tied well we're all in this together in that kind That's of right. sense exactly what what motivated you to participate in this to submit your work to be in this um in this process to be in this process yeah and the heart and the parade um, of hearts <laughs> well i just anytime you have something with such a positive you know mission statement how can you not want to be a part of that mm -hmm. and also i felt like this is something that came from, you know, my mind that I could put on a canvas and that could be part of this public art display. I know Tucker has said before that little else brings people together like art can. And so just to have, have my name attached to and be part of all of the other artists that have done such a great job is just humbling and an honor there for me. Go. I love it. So Sarah, these uh, hearts will be on display beginning March here all across Kansas City. You can go check them out. They're going to roll out a smartphone app. You can find them and track your path to go all see these hearts. And then they'll auction them off in June or July. And the money from that will go to help different charities and groups here in our area. And when you go looking for this heart, there's actually a secret sunflower about the size of a dime hidden in there. So that'll be something for you to go look for, Taylor and Ray. We will look for that. Charlie, yeah. did she make a bee joke that you missed? I just don't want her humor to, to go miss because we got it back here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Right, right, right. All right. Just making sure that you're That's able to keep fault. up. It is early this morning. <laughs> <laughs> so